the far outside run the tolls a straight charging hard at the extreme outside that's plcb that red river hanover is third from last out of truth to life and dragon.com silver d moon jetting to the front by arjan had him under maximum acceleration and paperback has worked out the two hole position third straight is on the inside third art maker landed in fourth it's five pacers back for plcb there's post time favored red river hanover racing from six that already moved to the outside the quarter was 26 seconds silver d moon and paperback third straight by two more lengths sitting along the inside from third art maker is fourth and on the inside fifth plcb with red river hanover edging up third from last still and following him on the way to the half second from last in seventh that was uh, truth to life ahead of dragon.com 54 and three silver d moon paperback on to the final turn red river hanover going it alone on the outside but he's been very well rated staying to the inside was third straight still there into that top four and moving up on the outside improved again truth to life is second over grateful for the cover of red river hanover third from last dragon.com art makers taking a shuffle and plcb was moved to the outside silver d moon paperback red river hanover first over truth to life spotted second over they passed three quarters in 123 and one down the stretch in the second division of the 2002 burlington stakes silver d moon right up alongside him is red river hanover coming from sixth at the quarter going a huge first over trip to be a drawing off winner in his burlington stakes division red river hanover silver d moon hung on for second then it was dragon.com with truth to life 150 and four red river hanover convincing victory in the burlington Number three, Red River Hanover, the seventh race winner, second division of the 2002 Burlington Stakes. Western Hanover, three-year-old Bay Colt from Rich and Elegant, owned by Lothler and Equestrian Center and Jeffrey Snyder. Trained by Bill Robinson, driven to victory by Randy Waples, doubling up in the Burlington Stakes. Red River Hanover's fourth win in six starts this year, 150 and four-fifths. Red River Hanover congratulated by some very special guests in Woodbine's winner's circle. Andy Bathgate from the NHL Alumni Association and clear the track Eddie Shack. Also retired NHL referee Ron Wicks is with us. Congratulations to all of you in the NHL Alumni Association for all of the terrific and worthwhile charity work you do and on your great NHL careers. Thanks again to Andy Bathgate, Eddie Shack, and retired referee Ron Wicks.